Gamers and creatives, this is the laptop you need, the Lenovo Legion 9i. It's a very powerful laptop, it's perfect for video editing and it can play graphic intensive games at the highest graphic settings. Plus, it looks good. Trust me when I say this is the best laptop I have used. It handled everything I threw at it but it's not perfect. In this video, I'm going to share with you what I like about it and what I wish was different. Shout out to Lenovo and Naimic for gifting me this incredible laptop. Opening up the box, this laptop comes with a user manual, a switchable keycap kit, and a 140 watts and 330 watts GAN adapter. Why does it have two adapters? Well, the 140 watts is smaller, lighter, and easy to carry around. It's the charger to use when you want to power up the laptop without running demanding tax. And when it's time to experience the full power of this laptop, that's when you use the 330 watts GAN adapter. Back to the laptop, the carbon design is beautiful. And I like that it doesn't attract fingerprints. This laptop has AI synced RGB lights at the front and back and even the keyboard backlight is RGB which you can customize more on that to come. Holding this laptop or carrying it in a backpack isn't an issue as it weighs 2.5 kg. For the ports and I.O., on the left side is where you will find the 3.5mm audio jack and an SD card reader. Moving to the right side, it comes with an e-shutter button to enable or disable the webcam, a USB Type-C port and a USB Type-A port. What I love about this laptop is most of the ports are at the back and the port icons are illuminated, making it easy to connect in the dark. You can even turn off the light if you want to. For the port, it comes with a power port. That's the port to use when you want to power this laptop with a 330 watts GAN adapter. Next to it is an HDMI 2.1 port. It has two Thunderbolt 4 ports, a USB Type A 3.2 Gen 1 port, and an Ethernet port. The power button is located right here and it doubles as the fingerprint scanner which you can use to unlock the laptop. It's fast and accurate. Unfortunately, the webcam that it comes with isn't Windows Hello compatible. Taking a look at the keyboard, you'll notice that it's been shifted down to make room for the fans. As a result, there isn't enough space to rest your wrists. The full-size keyboard on this laptop feels tactile. The key travel is 1.5mm and typing on it is satisfying. The sound it makes and how it feels when you press a button is good. The keys are backlit and you can customize the color by opening the Lenovo Vantage app. You can customize the color of the entire keyboard, some keys or even a single key. Now since it's RGB, you can choose the color, the effect and how fast you want the light to change. There's even a keyboard shortcut to switch between the keyboard light profiles. Speaking of the keyboard shortcuts, pressing FN and Q will toggle between the power modes. FN and R will change the display refresh rate. FN and U will turn on or turn off the pot lights. FN and L will turn on or turn off the light of the Legion logo on the lead. FN and arrow up or down will increase or decrease the keyboard backlight brightness and FN and spacebar will change the keyboard light profile. Moving to the touchpad, this is one of the things I don't like about this laptop. The touchpad is small and the location is off. Sometimes I find myself right clicking when I want to left click. Using the touch command can be frustrating. You definitely need an external mouse with this laptop. The display of the Lenovo Legion 9i is one of the best displays I have ever seen on a laptop. It's a 16 inch 3.2K mini LED panel with a refresh rate of 165 hertz. The top and side bezels are slim. It has an aspect ratio of 16 by 10. It's a VESA certified display for HDR 1000 and can get as bright as 1200 nits. The colors it shows are vibrant and accurate. It covers 100% of the DCI P3 color gamut and 100% of Adobe color space, which is super important for creatives. For gamers, this display supports NVIDIA G-Sync for smooth motion when playing games, and this is as far as it can go when you tilt it. How well does this laptop perform? It's impressive. This laptop is powered by the 13th gen Intel Core i9 13980HX processor with NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4090 laptop GPU. My model comes with 32GB of DDR5 RAM and 2TB SSD. With specs like that, you know this laptop means business. It handles video editing really well. I was able to edit a 6K footage with no issues using Adobe Premiere Pro. The rendering speed made me speechless, guys. Moving over to gaming, the power of this laptop blew me away. It ran Modern Warfare 3 at ultra settings and I didn't need to switch to performance mode or connect a 330W GAN adapter. It handled the game flawlessly. 
Moving to Forza, it played the game at extreme graphics, it handled the game well with no drop in frames. The way this laptop runs graphic intensive game is unbelievable and the speakers made gaming on this laptop immersive. Now this laptop comes with an AI chip, the LA2, it detects what's on the screen and tunes the system in real time to maximize performance. After gaming for an hour, the laptop didn't get hot to the touch, it has three fans that get loud when you perform demanding tasks like rendering a 6K video. Internally, things remain cool as this laptop is the world's first gaming laptop with liquid cooling tech inside it. The system engages at 34 degrees or 180 Fahrenheit to push an additional 10 watts of power and keeps the GPU cool. Now moving on to the Lenovo Vantage software, it's a useful software that allows you to customize and change some of the settings of this laptop. For example, you can overclock the GPU for better performance, you can enable or disable rapid charge or turn on or turn off the adaptive refresh rate to save a bit of power. As I mentioned earlier, you can customize the RGB lights, you can even enable eSport mode to show the FPS of the game you're playing. Plus, you can change the sound profile of the laptop. The webcam on this laptop is a 1080p camera. The video you're watching right now is being recorded by the 1080p webcam on the Lenovo Legion 9i. What do you guys think about the quality? Let me know in the comment section below. This laptop has two speakers and they sound good. They are loud but by default they don't produce enough bass. But you can fine tune the speaker with the Naimic app to make it sound better. I highly recommend you do this because it makes a difference. The Lenovo Legion 9i comes with a 99.99 watt hour battery. Using super rapid charge mode, charging this laptop from 0 to 70% takes 30 minutes and 0 to 100% takes 80 minutes. As for the battery life, it's not great. With normal usage, I got around 4 hours with 160Hz refresh rate turned on and the brightness was at 45%. For the price, on the Lenovo website, the Legion 9i starts at $3,419. Building one to match the specs I have will cost you around $4,000. Is this laptop worth the money? I think it is. And that's because it's not just a gaming laptop, it's also perfect for video editing and graphic designers. It's the best laptop for power users. For the negatives, the trackpad is small and it's not at the right position, the battery life is not great, only lasting around 4 hours from normal usage and the webcam quality is not that good. Also, the fan can get loud when you push it but that's to be expected as this is a powerful machine. All gaming laptops have loud fans. If you're on the fence and you're not too sure whether to buy this laptop, I think you should go for it. Trust me, you're going to love it. I'm going to leave links in the description of this video if you're interested in picking one up. So that's my review of the Lenovo Legion 9i. If you found this video to be useful, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and I'm going to see you guys very soon. Follow Reviews, signing out.